I condemn February 15, 1999 as some countries in Europe and the United States helped Turkey to arrest Abdullah Akalan, Kurdish leader and guerrilla movement leader, we call this day a black day for the Kurdish history, because Abdullah Akalan came to Europe to float Kurdish questions for the EU to demand the Turkish regime to give rights the Kurds in Turkey. The Kurds have no rights in Turkey we hear every day that the Turkish police torturing Kurds daily, all know that the 30 million Kurds living in Turkey, but you could say the Turks have occupied Kurdish country and, unfortunately, many countries are supporting the Turks against Kurds, especially the EU countries and the United States to help the Turkish government against the Kurds. Because we are asking European countries to pressure the Turkish regime to respect human rights, especially the rights of Kurds, many countries are talking about the democratic process in Turkey but we don't see any democratic system, on the contrary, we see only a completely racist system in Turkey. I'm a liberal, but has respect for all parts of the Kurdish ideas and political views, I believe in freedom and democracy, but also the freedom of freedom of opinion in Turkey, unfortunately only for the Turks do not for Kurds, I think the Turkish system should be changed and Turkey needs a federal system or federalism. We know that the United States has helped Kurds in Iraq we too are grateful for Bush's family as Kurdish best friend also United States, we hope that the United States require Turks to give the Kurdish people rights in Turkey, we are not the same as the Turkish culture, we are we are Aryans, and we have other language known as Kurdish, our clothes shape difference with Turkish clothing culture and plenty things that difference between us. We hope that all Kurdish political organization get together and try to get your own country we too hope that the world find a solution for the Kurds on the democratic way for Kurds to live in peace, I'll say one thing no one wants to take the weapons and war against all people like to live in peace those Kurdish guerrilla taken not weapons voluntarily to go to the mountain and the war against the occupying countries all want to live in quiet and tranquility but unfortunately those who occupied Kurdistan forcing Kurds to take to arms and defend themselves for torture and rape by the Turks and other occupying countries. Sincerely Samuel Kermashani